2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. Hello basketball fans, you've got it on 2K Sports as we get set to bring you an exciting NBA basketball game. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg and our sideline reporter David Aldridge. It's the Chicago Bulls and the Portland Trail Blazers. And Portland starts out with the ball. Let's check out Chicago's starting lineup. Longley out there with Dennis Rodman. Then there's Harper. Then there's Pippen. And it's Jordan in at the two. Here's Harper. He's looking for Jordan and finds him. Lays it up and banks it in. You know, Jordan is an accomplished scorer inside. I mean, feels like he can get whatever shot he wants on the block. Knocks it loose. And here's the fast break. Jordan leading the way. Here's Rodman and block. That one goes careening off the glass. Stoudemire against Rodman. Stoudemire inside. The shot comes out. Rodman with the defensive effort. Jordan, the pass to Hart. Oh, and that one, no question, powered it down. Yeah, and Jordan sees the floor so nicely. I mean, one of his guys has a clean look. He gets the ball to him in whip-like fashion. Now, here's Sabonis. Here's Smith. And good as it just snugs right down through the net. Wow, fired that bounce pass in there beautifully. And now Portland on the break. Pippen against Pippen. Smith outside. Back to Pippen. Up top, Shrimp. The pass to Smith. Rebound by the Bulls. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just, let's face it, he whiffs on that. Kept alive, Rodman. Goes up again. The put back, no good. Not a friendly rim at all this trip down. Putting up a goose egg, bagel this period. At this point, you have to run the offense through somebody else. I mean, that's your only choice. Pippen kicks to Smith. Shot clock at five. First quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. Down low. Sabonis trying to get open. Smith gets it to go on the assist by Stoudemire. And you're not going to pass up that kind of Smith's gotten two of his three shots to go tonight. To the middle. Here's Longley. Sabonis grabs the board. You know, even though it's a point-blank range shot, that's not an easy one, especially when the defense is that tight. Pass to Pippen. Smith outside. And trying for the go-ahead basket. It doesn't go in. Now the Bulls with it. Outside Jordan. That one doesn't drop. Now Portland takes it the other way. Smith scanning the floor. Pass to Pippen. Shrimp with it. He kicks it to Stoudemire. Pocket six. And that one is good. A defensive breakdown there, no doubt about it. I mean, he's a guy you have to be focused on defensively. And the first time out of the game called for Chicago. And they just can't seem to get going offensively. And I think this time out, guys, is where you draw up some plays that are guaranteed to create some high percentage shots. Trying to end the drought. Rodman with the bucket. It took him a while, but he finally gets one to fall. 
and it's Smith with the ball. He brings it up for the Trailblazers. Up top, Shrimp. Here's Pippen. And misses it off the right side of the rim. Harper against Stoudemire. Here's Longley. Missed inside. And that one gives them a plus five rebound advantage, Kevin. Pretty clear they're dominating that area. They've come out with a lot more energy and effort so far. Now, here is Shrimp. Doesn't go that time. Some solid defense by Rodman. Jordan up top. Outside for Pippen. That drops and it comes off an assist from Jordan. Scotty Pippen, a dependable shooter from here now. Like how he gets his feet set first. That's fundamental, but he's central. Here's Stoudemire. Tries yet again. No luck, they battle on the glass, but couldn't knock it down. You know, he just has not been himself this period. Just too inconsistent up and down at the offensive end. Sabonis so against Harper. Rodman trying to break free. Harper, no good. That's not the type of opportunity he fails to convert very often. Pippen misses. Well, you know, stopping him is never easy to do, but the defense was strong there. Jordan with him. He's picked up by Pippen. Jordan's shot is off. Trailblazers trail by three. Here's Stoudemire. Another miss, and they've really hit a rough patch here. Well, I'll tell you what, he's going to buy himself a ticket to the bench if he keeps shooting it like that. He has been putrid here this quarter. And Harper, very versatile, athletic. Plays with some physicality, too. Um, he brings a little bit of grit and hustle along with some flair and skill. First trip to the line for him here. And he makes the first. The Bulls making a switch here. Wennington's checked in. And Harper drops them both. Trailblazers trail by five. And the first time out of the game called here for the Trailblazers. Yeah, things not going their way, and he wants to just try to talk this one over. And you know what, guys? If for nothing else, just to slow things down a little bit, change it up somewhat. Anthony looking it over. Grant against Rodman. Grant the pass to Pippen. And they get it. And it's Harper with the rebound. Chicago leading by five. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Really, uh, the right play defensively, if you can't block, force them to the line. Yeah, exactly. Prevent the layup, give them a little bump, and then maybe they'll think twice about coming into the lane next time. And if they don't think about it, at least they might be distracted by your presence. First free throw is good. Yeah. 
Ryan Harper drops them both. Anthony with it. And Brent now top of the key. To end the cold streak, Chicago grabs the miss. And a wide open look for Jordan. Wide open shot is on the money. Jordan's got his second basket of the night. Jordan getting quickly into the shot. No hesitation. Supreme confidence shooting off the pass. Bounce pass Anthony. Pippen against Pippen. Back to Grant. Just four to shoot. For three, Smith. He can't hit that top. And the Bulls going the other way now. To the inside. It's through for a second basket. He's now two for six. Their play on both ends has been superb. We, we'll see if they can maintain the momentum. And, you know, nothing like getting an opponent on the ropes early. You love that if you're on that side of the scoreboard. And they are landing some haymakers now. Kerr's checked in for the Bulls. Time called here. The Blazers decide to talk it over. Trail Blazers trail by 11. To the wing right side. Now here's Wells. Guarded by Pippen. Grant the pass to Anthony. And some nice ball movement here by the Trail Blazers. Passes it to Wells. The shot. The Trail Blazers with a new shot clock. Anthony, the pass to Wells. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. Dennis Rodman picks one up. And when Wells stays in control of his emotions, now he plays with a lot of energy and a bit of an edge, he's really terrific. Portland shooting their first free throws here tonight. A free throw drops for Wells. And Wells drops them both. Chicago leading by nine. Jordan dishes to Rod. There's the pass to Wennington. Outside Pippen. Five on the clock. From outside, off the mark. They've been sensational on the backboard to start this game. Yeah, sensational is a really good word for it. They're tearing it up on the glass. And didn't do anything fancy there, but didn't need to. Nope, he, his only concern right now is getting the points on the board. And I, I don't mean style points. Hey, I thought there was some style there, guys. What are you guys looking at? I mean, it was still a pretty sweet, flavorful one-hand flush. You know, the turnaround jumper, guys, is one of those shots that always just look so good. I mean, it's got that nice, smooth, singular motion. Sweet. Now, here's Will. Pass to Ogden, and stolen by Jordan. Outside for Pippen. And it's Pippen again missing. Here's Ogden. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Pass to Wells. Now, here is O'Neal. Just five on the clock. Now the dish to Anthony. O'Neal passes to Ogden from downtown. The rebound by Pippen. And close to making the defense pay for the lax coverage that time. And the shot is good. And it's an 11-point Chicago lead. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. Out to the right wing. Ogden passes to Grant. 
to the paint. Passes to Ogden. Over to the wing. Now Anthony. Fires the three. And they get it back inside. Here's Grant. And three chances on that possession. But they just couldn't find a way to score. Here's Jordan. He can't get it to go. Now the Trailblazers take it the other way. A minute 20 left to play here in the first. Now here's Wells. The pass to Ogden. It's stolen by Kerr. Here's Pippen. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. Pippen's got seven. And what's your take, guys, in the hustle sticks for Chicago? Boy, they've really amped up the pressure at the defensive end, guys, and have piled up the steals in the early going. And the other thing that's been equally as effective is the fact that they've gotten out on the fast break. A lot of points coming in transition. Kerr can't hit. And it's Anthony with the ball for Portland. Trailing by 13. Right wing. Down low, trying to get something going. Six on the shot clock. Good ball movement here by the Trailblazers. For three. Rodman grabs the miss. Rodman's got 11 rebounds in the game. Jordan. Pippen dishes to Jordan. Drops in the layup for two. He's got six. And Scottie Pippen so good at surveying the floor. Like seeing him find the open man with those sweet dishes. Here's Wells, and that would have counted, but his uh, shot was off the mark this time. And so it's Chicago, riding a 15-point lead at the end of the quarter. They've excelled in the open court. Their transition game has allowed them to build this healthy lead. Back to the action after this word. Just tuning in. We've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but uh, plenty of time left for a comeback. And guys, we've seen a confident-looking Bulls team out there. Aggressive at running guys to the backboard. You could tell it was part of their game plan coming in. Yeah, and you know, when a team establishes an edge on the glass early, it really sets things up for the rest of the game. On the court right now, second quarter for the Bulls. They've got Tony Kukoc. Kerr out there with Michael Jordan. Then it's Simpkins. And it's Pippen in at the three, the small four. Now, here's Kerr. They lead by the biggest margin of the game, 15 points. Pippen, no luck. Not sure why he keeps trying his luck from deep here. It's just not his night. Wells passes to O'Neal. And the rejection by Pippen. And it's always been about the effort defensively for Pippen, known as a stopper and a fantastic shot blocker to boot. And the Trailblazers making a change here. Ball's not loose. Jordan. Here's Kerr. That's a miss. His second after two shots. Stoudemire against Kerr. To the left side wing. Stoudemire right side. Pass to Ock. Down to five on the shot clock. He's now one for two with that bucket. I like the play call. Very solid, making perfect use of the pick to get a great look. Outside, Kukoc. Over O'Neal. Misses off the left iron. Trailblazers trail by 13. Pass to Ogman. And now approaching two minutes of action here in the second quarter. It's good for his second make. He's made two or three so far. And here is Jordan. Six points for him. Hey, yo, right here. 
here he goes. And they double up Jordan. And wrestling for it there, but no one has possession. We'll have a jump ball. And so here is Chicago. Kerr, the pass to Jordan. The Bulls need to get a shot off here. Open for three. And it's Portland with the rebound. And, you know, he's a threat from deep, no doubt about it. But it just has not been there for him tonight. You might want to change your game plan a little bit offensively. Here's Ogman. O'Neal kicks to Wells. Here's Ogman, guarded by Jordan. Ogman passes to O'Neal. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. The Bulls leading by 11. Passes it to Kukoc. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. The Bulls have hit all four of their chances so far in this one. And he knocks down the first one. Some changes for Chicago. Luke Longley's checked in for Pippen. Bushler comes in for Michael Jordan. And it's Harper in for Kerr. Kukoc hits them both. Trailblazers trail by 13. Stoudemire outside to the middle. Pippen against Kukoc to the inside. Harper lays it up off the glass. Harper's got eight points. Yeah, and what you love about Kukoc is the versatility on offense and, and the terrific court vision. And there's the pass to Shrimp. Now Pippen. And it's Stoudemire in the corner. Driving to the basket. The shot's good on the assist by Pippen. Stoudemire's got his second basket of the game. And here in the second quarter of action as we approach four minutes played. Harper against Stoudemire. Harper the pass to Bush. Poked loose. Sabonis with the steal. And another turnover here by Portland. Rodman is checked in for Simpkins. The Bulls leading by 13. Outside Harper. Pass to Bush. Kicks to Kukoc. Pass to Longley. Rodman trying to break free. Sabonis grabs the ball. Smith outside. He dishes it to Pippen. After two misses to start the game, he's on the board with that shot made. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now they've allowed from point blank range. Can't happen. Here's Long. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. Six to shoot. And again, Chicago. No good. Here's Stoudemire. Yes, and it's Smith with the assist that time. Stoudemire's got it back down to single digits for Portland. Passes it to Bushley. Back to Harper. Now the pass to Long. On the wing, Kukoc. Shoots over Pippen. 
That's short off the rim. There's the drive, and it's Pippen slamming it down. And Pippen there driving hard inside has the height and athleticism to consistently get it done in the paint. Sabonis with the steal. And even three on three break. Harper against Pippen. Stoudemire the pass to Pippen. He kicks it to Shrimp. Here's Stoudemire. And it's Harper with the rebound. Harper's got four rebounds now tonight. Drives to the hoop. They need this one. Tries again. No good that time. And the Trailblazers going the other way. Here's Pippen. The shot's good. Pippen's got his third basket of the night. And now you see them starting to really work the ball inside. Outside, Kukos. They get a hand on it. And they're moving it up. Here's Stoudemire. The shot's good on the assist by Pippen. Now just a three-point Chicago lead. And not a great start for him in the first, but he's quickly starting to turn it around. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. As the teams head into this timeout, a chance for the coaches now to map out some plays for the next few minutes and a chance for the players to rehydrate with some Gatorade. That's important if they want to make sure they don't wear down later in the game. Absolutely. Over the course of a game, you have to stay hydrated. Grant, he's checked in for Portland. Here's Bushler. I've been trying to break free. Bushler's shot is off. And it's Sabonis with the ball for the Portland Trailblazers. The defense has only allowed four points in the quarter. And I like the fact that he really was unfazed by that scoreless first quarter. And now you can see him getting into a rhythm. Harper against Stoudemire. Here's Kukoc. To end the drought. And it's good on the way in. And they keep hammering away at him inside, forcing the ball into the paint. Outside, Sabonis. Back to Stoudemire. Takes the three. And another three for Portland. And I like watching Stoudemire stroke it from behind the arc. as a nice touch on these deep shots. Pass to Bushley. And here's Kukoc. Nice D from Sabonis. Portland leading. Here's Pippen. Unable to get that one. Kukoc with the defensive effort. Here's Harper. Second chance shot. Up again. It's good on the putback. Way to work the glass, buffet style. Second chance bucket. They can make a big difference. To the right side. Grant gets a wide open look, and it's good off the back of the rim and in. And the Trailblazers lead by one. Harper the pass to Bushler. Outside, Cuckoo. Portland grabs the miss. Smith's got four rebounds now tonight. The three. And another three for Portland. Well, they're getting a lot of their points outside the paint. Three of their last five baskets are from three-point range. Pippen against Kukoc. Shoots over Pippen. Kukoc can't get it to go. And another miss. Woo. He's having a really ugly game. Yeah, about as ugly as you can have. You're right. High arcing shot. Sabonis with the bucket. It, it really does make the game easy for your teammates when you can lead them to the rim that well time out, time with the pass. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. And they just can't seem to get going offensively. And I think this timeout, guys, is where you draw up some plays that are guaranteed to create some high percentage shots. So Chicago going with an almost entirely new group here. Wennington, he's checked in for longer. 
Pippen comes in for Tony Kukoc. Michael Jordan, he's checked in for Bushel. And Steve Kerr is subbed in for Ron Harper. Great offensive performance they're putting on. And guys, we call that the zone because that's where they are right now. They are in a zone, and I'm sure they feel unstoppable. Now here's Anthony. Pass to Ogman. Outside Jordan. Over Ogman. And again, no good by Chicago. Outside Jordan. Back to Rodman. They need this. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Jordan. Jordan's got his third assist on the night. Trailblazers leading by four. Out left to the wing. Outside, Sabonis. Full team, Sabonis. And a bit of a battle here for the ball. The official signals a jump ball here. And Portland has possession. Grant the pass to Anthony. Five to shoot. Here's Ogman. No good on the three. Bulls trail by four. 103 left in the first half. It's Pippen with the drive. And it's Pippen slamming it down. Way to punch it, Scotty Pippen. The athleticism. Impressive. Pass to Wells. Three-pointer. That's basket number two with his third shot off to a fast two for three. You know, pretty much anybody can hit that shot when they're that wide open. I mean, terrible defense. To the paint. And the dunk by Jordan. No doubt about the brilliance of Jordan as a player. Outstanding at knowing when to go get that alley-oop. 35 seconds left in the first half. Here's Ogman. Grant up top. Outside Anthony. Grant kicks to Anthony. Portland needs to get off a shot. Trailblazers moving the ball around. And they recover it. Sabonis. And that one is good with the extra effort on the glass. Sabonis has got his second buck. Kerr against Anthony. That one's in there. The Trailblazer lead is cut to just three points on the basket from Jordan. Boy, at the offensive end, his game is so impressive. I mean, he's a threat every time up the floor. And that's it for the first half of action in what's been a very close game here. Trailblazers lead by three. We're going to step away briefly, but get you right back out here for the start of the third quarter after our halftime. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Good to see you back here on our halftime show. Well, actually, we can't see you, but you can see us, but you get it. Ernie Johnson, Kenny the Jet Smith, Shaquille O'Neal. You're watching the NBA on 2K Sports. Some struggles for Portland in the first quarter. They were completely overwhelmed and unable to play any sort of defense early and were in a blowout situation by the end of the period. Their second quarter, however, was a monumental improvement. Nothing could stop them. They strung together basket after basket to lead by three now at the half. What do you think about Portland, Kenny? We have to recognize their bench play. Sometimes we overlook the second half, but tonight they've been the key. The coaching staff has got to be loving this, getting that extra boost. How about you, Shaq? What did you think about Chicago? I like the way they rebounded. They devoted a lot of energy down low, fighting for each other on the boards, and they helped keep this game tight. If they can continue to do that, it could easily be the factor that swings the game in their favor. And that should do it. With the second half about to begin, let's send you back to Kevin Harlan. Go back to Kevin Harlan. Go. Just go over there. And if you're just joining us, we've played through the first half in a game that's been fairly even so far. Bulls trail by three. Our second half of basketball and presented by Gatorade. Let's see who's all fueled up and on the floor to start the third. On the floor for Portland. Pippen is out there with strength. 
And it's Smith. And it's a bonus in at the five spot. Now, here is Smith following the miss by Michael Jordan. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Shrimp can be lethal from outside. He's somebody you have to D up on. The Trailblazers That's have been perfect right. at the line so far, albeit just two for two. Well, free throw drops for Shrimp. And Shrimp drops them both. It, it, it's been a really good day for him at the line. Some other bigs have well-documented problems on their free throws. He's not one of them. The shot's good from Jordan. That's the 10th straight point they've given up in the paint. And you know, it doesn't matter how good your defense is on the perimeter if you're going to allow easy ones inside like that. And out of bounds is Chicago Games possession. A fantastic mobile one block. This one deserves another look. And this is why coaches stress the importance of defense. Big block there in this close game. Here's Pippen. And the pass to Hart. Smith against Jordan. And they double up Jordan. Good! Jordan's got four this quarter. It's a great move, and he catches the defense completely off guard. Yeah, if that's a harbinger of things to come, he's looking at having a very big second half. Chicago trailing here. Outside, Harper. Dishes it to Jordan. Here's Pippen. No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. Smith on the wing, guarded by Jordan. Outside Pippen. Sabonis against Rodman. Sabonis, the pass to Pippen. Four on the clock for three. Smith! Rebound by the Bulls. Rodman's now the Bulls with it. Pippen with it. He's got nine. Sabonis with the steal. Harper against Stoudemire. That one's not going to go. Nice D from Pippen. Starting slow in this half. 0 for 3 so far. Here's Harper. Longley against Sabonis. It's tipped. Longley passes to Jordan. Shot clock at 6. Here's Harper. For the lead. Offensive rebound. Rodman. And out of bounds as the Trailblazers gain possession. Well, that's a moment he'd like to archive. Embarrassing lapse of judgment there. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Jordan against Pippen. Pass to Sabonis. Back to Stoudemire. Six on the shot clock. To stop the drought. And it's off the back rim. No good. And they haven't been able to turn it into a big lead, but their rebound advantage is starting to add up. Yeah, still close, but with their tough play on the boards, we're certainly seeing the effort. O'Neal's check in for Sabonis. Pippen against Pippen.
Here's Shrimp. Chicago grabs the miss. Offensively, the struggles continue. 0 for 5 to start the half. Inside. And finished off by Longwood. Time out, time out. This uh, game has a lot of character here in the third period. Six changes of the lead here. Intensity is the theme for this one. Now a timeout called by Portland. We've seen Michael Jordan really having a great game. He's really taking it to him inside. They got to find a way to slow him down. Portland trailing here. Poked away. Pass break. Here comes Chicago. Harper's shot. Good. Harper's got 10. Yeah, and, and Harper, hard to get around. A physical defender. He'll use that athleticism and reach to pester score. Now, here is Shrimp. Been for three. No good that time. Pass to Pippen. Back to Jordan. Pippen dishes to Rodman. Just five to shoot. Michael Jordan on the wing. Fades and shoots. Shrimp gets the rebound. Shrimp's got four rebounds in this game. To the inside, O'Neal. And he can't stop the run as he misses. The Bulls leading by three. No good. Hey, how about imagining if they were hitting their shots, how big the lead could be? But so far, that's not been the case. Shrimp with it. Guarded now by Dennis Rodman. And Pippen with the basket. The assist by Harper. Harper's got five assists in the game. And guys, let's get your take on the hustle stats for the Bulls. Defensively, they played with a lot of energy, and, and the steals we've seen are a result of that aggressiveness. Something that's also benefited them tonight are the turnovers they forced and the points that have come along with those forced turnovers. And the Bulls making a change here. New coach has checked in. Pippen, the pass to Shrimp. Now Smith. Stoudemire wide open. The top of the key jumper is on the mark. Stoudemire's got 13. And with those points, he puts an end to that 10-0 run by the Bulls. Outside Jordan. Back to Harper. Lock at six. A shot by Jordan, no good. Trailblazers trail by three. Here's Smith. Here's O'Neal. Makes it off the glass. O'Neal's got his first basket of the night. Well, I love the way he goes after it there. I mean, you've got to respect that. He's rewarded for his efforts of pursuing the ball. Harper gets to pivot. Jordan, the pass to Rodman. Good ball movement here by the Bulls. It's good. Pippen's got four points this quarter. Every time they get scored on during this run, it's come from inside the paint. Shot on the wing. Bucket is good. 15 points for Stoudemire. And Stoudemire has that silky smooth jumper. Gets it off so quickly. Pippen kicks to Hart. O'Neal against Kukoc. Passes it to Jordan. Over Smith. I've been trying to break free. Jordan can't get it to go. The three, Pippen. Yes, and it's Smith with the assist that time. Smith's got his fourth assist in this one. And you know, Steve Smith has a team first mentality. When one of his guys is open, he finds it. Now here's Kukoc. Michael Jordan on the wing. Outside Harper. Over Stoudemire. Harper, no good. There wasn't much defensive resistance there, guys, but somehow he blew it anyway. Missed opportunity. Stoudemire, the pass to Pippen. Here's O'Neal. Second chance effort, and the layup is good. 
and it's a four-point trailblazer lead. Yeah, coach's pet peeve there. No box out. Those are free points you're giving away. You've got to work harder on the class. Wasted no time on that one. Kukoc has got seven points. How about the shot selection of Tony Kukoc, a threat to sink the three ball? You got to chase him off of that line. Harper against Stoudemire. Harper dishes to Pippen. Now here's Jordan. 14 points for him. Six to shoot. Goes back up. And a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. And as a free throw shooter, Robin has his challenges. One of those guys who almost shoots a better percentage from the field. Chicago shooting their seventh and eighth free throw attempts for the game right here. That free throw, no good. Uh, probably a little draft in the arena tonight. He's the last guy you expect to miss the mark by that much. Absolutely. So Portland ends up going with the new group. Chicago also making some changes. Wennington, he's checked in for Jordan. And Kerr subbed in for Ron Harper. And he sinks the second. They should be in front right now, but he'll be relieved not to have come up totally empty there. Anthony against Kerr. Anthony down low, and he finishes nicely on the way. Anthony's got his first two points of the night. That's the kind of aggressive and assertive play they need as we get closer and closer to crunch time. The pass to Kerr. Buries it down low. Kerr's got the game tied up here for Chicago. I like the play call. Very solid, making perfect use of the pick to get a great look. And there's the feed to Wells. Pass to Augman. Sabonis trying to get open. And that one goes long. Augman's gone just two of six, shooting 33%. Here's Rodman. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly placed assist. Rodman's got 11 points. And Rodman, a solid inside score. Picks his spots well and uses his body well, too. Pass to Augman. Now Sabonis. Grant trying to break free. Sabonis, no good. Pushing it up. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. And after really leaning on that three-point shot in the first half, seeming like they're uh, just getting away from it here in the second. More of the shots coming from the interior. The Bulls have been good at the free-throw line. This one, seven of eight. good on that one and so it's Anthony bringing it up for Portland to the middle here's Grant that shot is off so the Bulls will take it the other way guys we've seen some excellent offensive output yeah great momentum for them offensively upside Pippen Anthony against Kirk. Passes it to Cooper. And the three off target. Trailblazers trail by four. Anthony, the pass to Grant. And the dunk by Grant. And surprisingly, a firm throwdown. And that's a little bit out of character, Kevin. It is, Greg. You're right. He's got plenty of size to attack the basket, but rarely does. Well, he certainly attacked it that time. I mean, that's what they want to see more from him. Here's Kukoc. Portland making their last shot. Augman pulls it in. You know, it's really surprising that they're up at this point, given that he struggled so mightily. And out of bounds as the Bulls gain possession. Luke Longley's checked in for Chicago.
105 left to play here in the third. Kerr kicks to Pippen. Outside, Kuko. Nels with the steal to the inside. Here's Rodman. Kerr against Anthony. Fades back. Longley can't get it to go. Portland trailing here. And he's going up for the alley-oop. That ties the game. Oh, and just a soft touch on both ends of that pretty alley -oop. I got to say, when he threw the pass, I didn't know where it was going. Neither did the defense. Now here's Pippen. 13 points in the game. It's tipped. And he gets it back. And finished off by Longley. And those plays can make a difference in a game like this. <laughs> well, you know it's going to fire up, Greg, everybody on that bench. Making a statement for sure. I mean, we'll see if they can maintain that aggressive approach, guys. Now Sabonis. For the lead. And no luck with that time on the buzzer beater. We're at the end of the third, and we've still got a close one. It's the Bulls up two. Don't go anywhere. The final quarter is coming up next on 2K Sports. And it's time to bring up the State Farm assist of the game. And he sliced the D wide open with this feed. They had no chance to prevent that basket. Yeah, that's just a brilliant read of the defense. I mean, it was also excellent anticipation of the movement of his teammates before the pass. Just great harmony on all sides. I speak for all of us when I say I can't wait to see what kind of finish awaits us here in the fourth quarter. So for Chicago right now, we got Longley. Tony Kukoc is out there with Dennis Rodman. Then it's Kerr, and it's Pippen in at the two. Now, here's Grant. And there's the pass to Ogden. Down to five on the shot clock. Wells dishes to Grant over Rodman. No good from Grant. That's a shot he's got to hit. You don't get many looks better from that range. Kukoc passes to Pippen. With the drive. Pass to Longley. Outside, Kukoc. For three, Kerr. They get it back. Rodman. Good for basket number seven tonight on a not-so-unlucky 13 shots. Boy, you can't give him any room to maneuver on the board because once he does, he's going to make you pay. Ogman passes to Grant. Wells in the corner. Back to Grant. Trailblazers moving the ball around. Shoots a fader, and they turn over the 24-second buzzer, signaling the shot clock violation. The Bulls leading by four. Pass to Kerr. About a minute and a half through the fourth quarter now. Passes it to Longley. Outside, Kukoc. Shot clock at six. The pass to Kerr. Fires from deep. It's hauled in by the Trailblazers. You know, even though they're on top in this one, you'd like him to be better out there because he's capable of being better. It sure would make things a lot easier, too. Now here's Anthony. Pass to Ogden. Outside, Sabonis. Shoots over Longley. Pulled the shot a little left, but the bounce goes his way. Boy, you got to respect the J of Sabonis. I love seeing him spot up from here. Fourth quarter of play, we're about two and a half minutes through it right now. 
Here's Pippen. Another shot. Nice move. Rodman trying to break free. In deep. Pippen drops it in. And the Bulls lead by four. Those defenders just look a little bit gassed. I mean, they're getting pushed around on that low block. Wells passes to Sabonis. Over curve. Second shot opportunity. And Sabonis lays it up and in. And that huge frame of Sabonis is a problem for the defense. Excels at getting perfect position on that offensive glass. Now here's Pippen. Augman pulls it in. Augman's got rebound number five here tonight. A look at the clock. A little under three and a half minutes gone here in the fourth. Knocked away. Stolen by Pippen. A fader. And it's Pippen again missing. Here's Anthony driving inside. And they're unable to get the tying basket there. Chicago leading. Kerr kicks to Kukoc. Wants to get it to Rodman and dies. Got it. Good job in the low post. Rodman's got nine points here in the second half. He has created some terrific opportunities for himself and really made the most of it. Here's Augman, guarded by Pippen. Augman passes to Wells. Now here's Anthony. Clock at four. Sabonis. Portland again, missing. Chicago leading by four. Up top, Kukoc. Pass to Longley. Over Sabonis. Chicago making some changes. Michael Jordan is checked in for Rodman. And it's Harper in for Steve Kerr. The Blazers on offense. So far in the fourth quarter, they've allowed just six points. Outside, Sabonis. And another make to his scoring column. His fifth basket of the game. Now shooting 5 of 11. And the D not really doing its job there. A little slow to react to the ball getting into the paint. Here's Jordan. And it's in there. And the Bulls lead by four. And Jordan is simply amazing at finishing through contact. Doesn't matter what you throw at him or who, he finds a way to score. Stoudemire goes in. Eight for 15 with that made basket. But he's not satisfied yet. Vital basket there. This is just the time and really just the situation when he looks to take over. And you know that's right. I mean, he's looking to put his stamp all over this game. And it's Pippen slamming it down. And Pippen there, driving hard inside, has the height and athleticism to consistently get it done in the paint. Now here's Stoudemire. Kicks it to Shrimp. Got a piece of it. Smith outside. He's looking for Sabonis and finds him. Good ball movement here by the Trailblazers. And for three, Kukoc grabs the miss. Kukoc has got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Here's Jordan. And slam dunk by Jordan. Outstanding finishing there by Jordan. Terrific at getting inside and powering the flush down. Here's Stoudemire. Oh, he blocked it and deflects off the backboard. Outside Pippen. Over Smith. Smith with the defensive effort. Trailblazers trail by six. Beyond the arc. It's hauled in by the Bulls. Kukoc has got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. Harper the pass to Jordan. Count it. Jordan's got six here in this quarter. I don't know what's happening defensively, 
but they're not putting up any resistance. I tell you what, it's, it reminds me of one of my college coaches who used to say, that ain't going to get it done. Time out, time out. That's five straight baskets in the paint now. And, and it's all about the release when you shoot the floater. Time called here. The Bulls decide to talk it over. Trying to find some answers offensively. Yeah, and you know, that's going to be the focus of this timeout. They need to come up with a spark to get the offense going. And now we present our New Balance player of the game, Dennis Rodman. And as you'd expect, he's done most of his damage in that low block. I mean, that was the game plan to get it to him in the paint and just let him go to work. And him boy has the big fella delivered. He has just killed them down low. And on our sideline, our reporter, David Aldridge. Well, I was able to listen in on what the Bulls coach was going over with his team. His demeanor was not one of the coach whose team was well ahead. He said, this is the time to turn up the heat, make one final push, and try to close out strong. See if they were listening, guys. Thanks, David. Here's Smith following the basket by Michael Jordan. Passes to Pippen. Stoudemire against Harper. And it's Jordan with the jam. He is certainly a dominant player. Michael Jordan, when he's in the zone, unstoppable. And so it's Smith with it. He'll bring it up for the Portland Trailblazers. Here's the pass to Shrimp. Outside Pippen. Here's Smith. Laid in with a nice touch off the glass. They've cashed in on a lot of second chance opportunities here in the second half. That extra effort will help them cut into this deficit. Now here's Ruck. Back to Jordan. Rebound by Smith. Smith's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Inside, Sabonis. In swing dunk by Sabonis. Strong move to the 10, trying to get his guys go. Hard not to get motivated, GA, right when your teammate makes that kind of play. You know, when you're looking to close the gap, you need guys who will take it upon themselves to step up, take the initiative, and make something happen. Rodman's shot is off. Trailblazers trail by six. Smith outside. The dish now to Stoudemire. Outside Pippen. Pass to Sabonis. And they force the shot clock violation. Great D. Jordan against Smith. Outside Harper. And the powerful one-handed slam. Got to stay in front of Ron Harper. I mean, when you give him room to dunk it, he's not hesitating. Smith against Jordan. Pippen against Pippen. Smith kicks to Pippen. Just five on the clock. A floater. It's all in by the Bulls. Longley's got his sixth rebound on the night. Stoudemire against Harper. Now here's Jordan. Not a lot of room. Pass to Longley. Harper with the ball. By Stoudemire. This is it to Jordan. She launches it. Drills the three pointer. And it's an 11 point Bulls lead. Jordan, really confident rising up from deep. When he's in rhythm, he sinks these outside jumpers. Stoudemire attacking, and he banks in the layup. Stoudemire's got 10 points here in the second half. Doing all he can so far, but they still find themselves trailing. Chicago leading by nine. Outside, Rodman. Outside, Harper. Now the pass to Jordan. The 19-foot shot again, Chicago. An effective score from the in-between area of the court. Jordan doing his thing. 
Pippen against Pippen. Smith outside. The shot's good on the assist by Pippen. 12 points for Smith. Defensively, there was a lack of aggressiveness, and it really made it easy for him to knock that shot down. Outside, Rodman. Pass to Jordan. And they double up Jordan. Back to Rodman. Five to shoot. Over Schrempf. The kick out to Harper. Outside Jordan. Here's Pippen. That misses off the backboard. They can score it here, but it won't mean much. Kevin, turn out the lights. This party's over. It might be. And they can just dribble the ball until the buzzer. Yeah, they got to be happy with the outcome. Stoudemire against Harper. And so it's Chicago winning this one. And in the win, a comfortable win in what was, I think, a pretty hostile environment. It, it really was. You, you know, it's never going to be easy on the road, but they didn't have too many problems with that tonight. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for being with us. We'll see you later.